Integrating them can be a very big benefit in making things efficient. The key challenge is there that um, it might be a black box and therefore you should not only review and analyze what the machine teaches you as potentially relevant, but you should also take a view as to what the information is that the model is built on. Because if you don't have a view of that information, you don't know why the model is presenting you information as relevant as such. Really make yourself an expert on what CHAP GPT can do, what it can't do, what it should do, and what it shouldn't do. And to me, that's, there's a security element and then there's an accuracy. So be thinking about what goes into CHAT GPT. Don't put your client's data in there. Don't put things into CHAT GPT that are, you know, that are private and you shouldn't. Also, make sure that you're using it as a first start and not necessarily as the, as the only. A technology like ChatGPT may be really good at developing a first draft um, of a response or a piece of information or research that's required. Um, however, it still requires the experience and the training and the judgment of a lawyer to be able to review the content to make sure it's correct, to make sure it's accurate uh, before it gets applied in a client situation. We're not at the stage now where we have access available to simply put client information into a you know, large language model. There needs to be a process where it is securely um, implemented within a platform or an infrastructure so that you can take advantage of these technologies. A point I've, I've often uh, highlighted is we might know as humans that when we're in a courtroom, if you see the judge raise an eyebrow when a witness is giving a statement, we know Maybe he's a bit doubtful. Maybe he doesn't believe that, that lady. Uh, maybe he wants a certain point reinforcing. Technology platforms that are especially text-based can't absorb those types of nuances right now. So as a lawyer practitioner, it's a great accelerator, but you just have to know about the guardrails to put around it.